You want this one? No. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we usually have it off, right? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, the center one. Go ahead. No, we need that. Yeah, that's dark as Yeah, we have it on. No. No, it's usually this one we have off. Yeah. Yeah, this one we have on. Damn, is he? Three, like three weeks? Three weeks and we don't even remember ourselves. What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. Brando! Clinton. And this is Brewheads. Uh, you guys might not have realized with the videos that we still keep posting out over the holiday season, but we've been off for three weeks. Three weeks! So, uh, excuse us if we're a little uh, rusty. A little rusty. Today, we have from back east, the one, the only, only ice cream man. Oh, yeah. Oh, snap. Oh, yeah. You did. You did. We, yeah. just, we got it. We got it. We got it. Oh, boy. Now, once again, if you follow us on social media, you would have saw, um, what was it, back in, uh, yeah, right before, right before, Christmas. Right before yeah. Christmas. Uh, they had canned it and put it out there. Um, we were late. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, we we do have uh, regular jobs outside of this that... Uh, We'd like to change that eventually. Yeah. Right. Me and Brando were lucky enough to leave early, and uh, we were able to get down there, what, 3.15? 3.15. And they were sold out. At 2.30. Yeah. They we were, still had a good time. We had yep. it on tap. Yep. We on they tap. had it on tap. Do they make this an IV? They should. They should. They, should. they, they really should. should. Yeah, uh, cans, tap, bags. So, uh, can we open them? I kind of want to open it. Yeah, yeah, we open let's it. crack this. Back East, Ice Cream Man, a Citra India Pale Ale. No sh This is, this is an absolute amazing beer. 6.4, 12 ounces, contains no dairy. You'd think it would with the creamsicle cream type cream thing. Yeah. yeah. But this is good. I, I like the fact that it, it, it hangs in there just at the bottom of my alcohol. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's right there. It's right there at my yeah. like I, I don't like to really go any lower than six. I can all avoid going lower than six anyway. And I love ice cream man so much that I'm actually glad actually I'm content with the amount of alcohol on it. Yeah. It's 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 almost flawless. This is definitely a uh at a party, oh, you yeah. could drink it all day. Exactly. You could right drink it all there. night at yeah. the party it's right there. And, and not get so obliterated. <laughs> yeah. No bitter. Yeah. All right, let's uh, take a let's sniff. <sighs> the the aroma. Yeah, the aroma. It just citric. hits you right there. Yeah. Mm. The aroma is good. It's got the that color citric. is yeah. amazing. The like, color, that's. So, you know what? We that's were dirty. Though. We were having a discussion earlier, and I had a, a beer that. Um, was supposed to be fruity. It was supposed oh, was to be the pineapple. Juicy, the pineapple. Uh huh. It was supposed to be, and it wasn't. It was a single IPA, which this is, and it was see through. When your beer is supposed to have a good like flavor, juice, exactly. juice. Yeah. It should not be see through. See, no see through. Nope. Yeah, you ain't seen through this at all. Yeah, that's a good dirty right there. This is one of those ones you would put up and you would go, this is a juicy, dirty beer. Yeah, exactly. You see how you can't see through? You know that's full of flavor. Yep. Mm. Clayton already said. Uh, not yet. No. I'm, I'm waiting. You're waiting. waiting. All right, all right. All right, all right. Let's, yeah, let's, let's sip this bad boy. I'm sorry, Tony. Oh, God, it's so good. Oh, no. So, the flavor of this beer, it has that not overbearing, not strong, just the the slightest. Hmm, what is that? That orange creamsicle flavor, just not overbearing. No, not pow punch you in the face. I'm an orange creamsicle. It says, "Hey, I'm here." It just you drink it, and it's like, hmm. I gotta ask, is this? <sighs> I'm getting. Like graduations of the flavor and then dying away. Yeah. You get like this whole flavor all the way through? No, no, you don't. don't. You get, yeah, it's a grad, that's what I was saying. It's not a punch in the face. It's just a gradual, excuse me, what's that flavor? It tastes so familiar. And then it just gradually goes away. Yeah. Why? Which is good. It's so subtle. You get some beers that it'll, like, it'll punch you with hop or it'll punch you with juice. 
this one has like the perfect blend of juice hop flavor and it just gradually tickles yeah. your taste buds as it goes yep. by your tongue when you when you think of craft beer i feel like this is the pinnacle of when you think of craft beer what you expect from a craft beer invention yeah exactly yeah and ice cream man hits every point available i mean there's i don't i, I can't even see somebody not liking this to be honest with you i mean unless you don't like fruit yeah you know what it's yeah. what it's definitely you get some people who don't like the juice they just yeah. rather eat the hot I, that's weird yeah but no, this is, you know, I know, honestly, I haven't talked to anybody who has had a back east and who had an ice cream man who did not say, right. who said they did not like it. I was at a, um, I was at the, the store I go to and I was talking to someone when we were shopping around beer and I was telling them, you know, oh, you know, back east, they're going to be dropping ice cream man soon. And he's like, really? Really? When? <laughs> It's a beer that everyone gets excited for. If if yeah. you're a fan of Back East, you know. You know, this is really, really good. Yeah. You got the alert set up, you got everything yeah, exactly. ready to get watching out for ice cream. You're you, leaving work early to make sure you go get some. And still yeah, not get it. And still not get it. <laughs> oh, no, we did get it though. Yeah. We did get it. Yeah. Lucky enough. But yeah, this this really is, you know. You think about like craft beer, okay, they're gonna put out a lager, they're gonna put out an ale, they're gonna do some kind of double IPA, they're gonna do this. But this, this is invention. Yeah. You know what, in all honesty, the whole, the real good thing, and probably one of the things, the reasons why we gravitate towards Back East is the fact that they're not afraid to experiment with the beer and to try to come out with something interesting. We're gonna have to make a little reference, a little side note. Uh, we're gonna have to go back and get some more. Yeah. Some more. Yeah. yeah, as soon as, as soon as we find out when they're uh, this, putting out more, we'll definitely, if you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as soon as we get it, we will retweet it because just because yeah, because everyone who loves craft beer deserves to try this. So. Yeah, as soon as they put it out there on social media, we'll be we'll be throwing yeah. it out there as well. Yeah, we'll share it. So uh, this is something you like. I'm we upset. Ex we experienced yeah, it. I am there. upset. I'm a little pissed. Okay, come now, but this is no. our last. This is our last three. I, I don't, <laughs> like I start after the, the first sip, I was like, no, I don't want it to end. <laughs> and right. I keep sipping it, and I'm watching it go. So, oh, we, oh yeah. you did it! Yeah. You did. It's Ooh, done. Are you okay? I'm all right. You gonna make it? Yeah. I'm not even sure if we really have to rate this. I think as much I mean, as you we've can gone, tell. yeah, as much as we've gone on, you know, this is a buy for all three of us. I, mean, I just, I, I literally, think, I literally just got the the mini fridge in my room, and this is a beer that I could say would take up the entire. I would stock my mini fridge with this, like, I because like like Mike said, the alcohol content's like at the, the my minimal base for what I like to to purchase and keep around. This is something that you can drink all day or you can sip on, you know, it's, oh God, it's fucking good. <laughs> and, and you know what the thing is, is like, and I feel bad because I forget how good it is. I, this is right? the first time I've had it since we were there. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. then I'm drinking, I'm like, why is this not in my fridge right now, you know? Yeah. Like, this... I'm disappointed I don't have this at home waiting. You know, in all honesty, I don't know. I'm surprised you held on to this for so long. Yeah, you know what? And that's the thing. You had it for a little, month. No, right? yeah. I couldn't okay, so, make it three so hours. We have no. all come to realize. Couple weeks. Couple weeks. Yeah, we, not a month. I might. No, a couple. No. No, it's no been, since since the can. Where's the can date? Yeah, the twenty something. The twentieth. Right. I've had this since the twentieth. All right. So and that's like and it's the seventh right now. That's right. huge. So inside, little Brewheads Insider, we have come to realize that in order to save beer for reviews that we like, we have to purchase it the night before. <laughs> no, I have to hold on to yeah. them. I am the only one with the willpower. I have several beers in my fridge that I that we're waiting for review. Yep. And I haven't 
at them. I stare at them all the time. Even when I'm out of beer, I stare at it and I go grab water. You know, you know what's funny is that uh, I I'm surprised because I ran out of beer a few days ago before I just restocked. I started eyeballing the Magoo. <laughs> oh, I, I started eyeballing. It. I'm like, I was thinking, oh, maybe I'll just crack it open, but it's got that wax seal on the top, and I'm like, no, they'll know, they'll know. Like, it's I'm amazed that's lasting. The Magoo, and, it's, and then for the back east ice cream man. For you to help sit yeah. on after that, yeah, part. I, mean, I know damn well me and Brando couldn't do that. You know it's funny because you know, I had counted it. It was like we only need three, and then there, <laughs> one of those. You're trying to reason. One of those is definitely <laughs> mine because it was a six pack. We only need three for the review. I could have one, and then the other two got one for later, and then we just have the three for. But I, you, that was good. The first time I had this was your son's graduation, I think. Yeah, mm -hmm. and. My girlfriend liked it. Uh, shout out to Katie Maglio. And you were, so she liked it and you were going, oh God, it's gotta be crap then if she likes yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if she likes it, it's gonna be horrible. Well, she didn't like the Jigawatch, which kind of bothered me. You know, cause that, oh, was, that oh, was my- Side note, I have proved that my wife likes Jigawatch. There you go. She would drink it. She wouldn't buy it. She would drink it. And that's saying a lot cause she hates all beer. No, it'd be awesome if she could try ice cream in. Oh, she wouldn't like this. What she did like, she liked ice cream, man. Um, she actually said that she wanted to go to the brewery. We've actually, me and her, we actually did the brewery several years ago. We did the tour and everything. Yeah. Uh, I definitely do not recall ice cream man back then, though. So <laughs> I know I definitely want to take her. We should probably do that. We should probably do like a triple date. So I'll go down very, you know, back east. Very, like I said, it's almost like family. You know, we should yeah. do a triple date and go down there. And, Tear it up. I think this honest, this beer has made me think of adding a fourth rating to our category. Drink but not buy. Yep. Buy, wait in line. Oh. 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 Waiting in line. Waiting all day. in line. Waiting yeah. in line. Waiting in line. So, we'll end with that. If my job allows. I would wait in line. I would. And that's wait not in line. something that I. That's a waiting line for me. Yep. Yeah, I'll yeah. wait in line. I'll wait in line for that too. Thank so, you guys for watching. Thank yep. you for this beer. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Tony at Back East. Thank you, Keegan at Back East. If you guys want to give us a little on the down low, like when you're going to be releasing this so we can plan accordingly. Right, because we got this. Let's see how far we can push it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so, uh, you're so pretty. <laughs> as always, uh, hit that like button. Hit that notification. Subscribe. Make sure you subscribe. We do. A, we have a video come out every Wednesday and Sunday. And Sunday. And Sunday. And Sunday. So, Most importantly, drink local. Yes. Drink, drink local. local. Drink local. Check out Back East. Have a great day. See you on the next one. Won't be better than ours. <laughs>